Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Sam and I would love to have you guys subscribe so you won't miss out on any new videos. So today I am actually back with another hygiene video and today we are going to be doing hygiene products that I will forever repurchase and that are like my all-time favorite. I don't know what I'm going to call this video. It's something along those lines of like these are my top tier hygiene products that I think are just my favoriteest out of all my collection and I will continue to repurchase them. So yeah, I'm here. It is a lovely afternoon. I have my mini Diet Pepsi and I'm just living life. So why don't we just go ahead and get this video started. We're going to keep this video fun and go in random order. I kind of just want to sit here and like chit chat about, you know, all my favorite hygiene products. So I apologize if this video is a little bit longer, but first product is my favorite scrub of all time. This is Tree Hut Cotton Candy Scrub. I love this scrub so freaking much, you guys. Now, this is my second one of these. You guys know I already finished the very first one I had, and I had to go back and buy another one because I just love it so much. I think there's something about this packaging and the color of it that just makes me really want to use it every single time I shower. I don't know. I'm a, such a packaging girl where, like, if something is cute, I want it. <laughs> It doesn't really matter about, like, sometimes I just genuinely love the product, and there's sometimes where, like, tree head scrubs all kind of work the same. They're pretty much the same formula. It's just different color and scent. But I really love this. Paired with Boardwalk Taffy or Cotton Candy Clouds, if you have that one. Just, like, amazing. The best ever. Uh, something about this pink color. This one's a very new bottle or tub. So you guys can see that perfect swirl and that beautiful color. My friends say that they smell strawberry in this, but I smell like a very like sugary, sweet cotton candy scent in here. So I will always repurchase this. These make your skin feel baby freaking smooth. If I had to choose, you know, between a Dove body polish and a Tree Hut scrub, I would choose Tree Hut for sure. Next up, we have a bar soap. And I have tried so freaking many bar soaps in my hygiene, you know, I don't know, life, I guess. I've tried a lot of different ones. And I always go back to my tried and true Dove white bar. This is just a regular white bar. Also, the sensitive skin one, There, I feel like all of, like, the unscented ones are pretty much the same. But I always love a classic Dove white bar. I don't really need to talk about this too much. It is just the perfect base clean, and you can use it literally everywhere. You can use it on your downstairs area, and it doesn't irritate me. It makes me feel super, super clean. It's very moisturizing, and I just love it. You can find this at Dollar Tree, and I love that about it. Like, it's just so affordable for everyone. So, yeah, I'm just going to run through this one pretty quick. Next up, we have a, I guess, kind of like another base clean item. And this is my Dr. Bronner's Pure Castile Soap. This one is in the citrus scent, but honestly, any of them, I don't really mind the scent of any of them. I love the formula of it. This is one of the things where, like, it's not about the scent. I just genuinely love this brand. And basically, this is going to keep you super squeaky clean. So for the summertime, this is perfect. I always talk about this, but it is genuinely just one of my favorite products. And I feel like I will always repurchase this because I feel so clean. I feel like a new woman after using this. You do want to dilute it a little bit. So, you know, Keep that in mind. You can also use it for like 18 other things or like purposes. So I think that's super cool about it. Like we love a dual functioning product. Um, you can find this at Target, Walmart. I've even seen it sometimes at Marshalls, which is really cool. They have like the big, big bottles, like huge bottles. So it will definitely last you a long time. But yeah. Next thing I have is a washcloth. Of course, we cannot live without our washcloths. These specific ones are the Room Essential brands from Target. They are my favorite. I have tried to look for them online on the Target like website, but I can't seem to find them, but I always see them in stores. So go into like the, I guess the towel section and they come in like a pack and they have all different colors. 
they feel so nice and I just love these washcloths they are super soft but they also are good at scrubbing another thing I totally forgot to bring in this video is my silicone body scrubber you guys know I have been obsessing over that and I will always continue to have that like I think I'm kind of like done with loofahs I know shocking because I used to be a huge loofah girl but back to the washcloths these are amazing especially for you know the Dr. Bronner soap or the Dove white bar and I know some people also use this for like uh, liquid soap I personally sometimes feel like it doesn't lather as much as I would like it to these are really great if you guys are new here basically it's a lot more sanitary and it will really help you like scrub your body and get into like the crevices like behind your neck and then after you're done using it one time you can just chuck it in your laundry basket and have a fresh clean new one every time you shower so there's not going to be any bacteria on this because you're going to wash it so yeah next up we have liquid body wash so first one I have to share with you guys is the OGX what do you call it liquid this is a body cream and not the body wash it's okay you guys get it the OGX coconut coffee body wash and body cream these are products that I just cannot live without like I love this scent so much like it smells so amazing so amazing that I bought a backup of the body wash it's the scrub and wash they just smell so good lather beautifully they're not very exfoliating I just really enjoy the scent so that's why I will continue to repurchase it I mean a lot of times I feel like I'm not super super in love with a specific scent but this one takes the cake it's just so comforting and warm and I just love it so much. I feel like it's the perfect warm scent for any season. In the fall time it's great, the winter, summer, spring. I use it all year round and I just really love the formula of OGX body washes. The body creams, honestly you guys, I'm not going to lie, some of them do not rub in very good. They just don't. They kind of like will continue to stay like white, like have a white cast on my body. No matter how much I rub it in, I feel like it gets whiter and whiter, which is so weird. I wish they would change the formula a little bit. The coffee one is not as bad, but the Shea, Shea Soft and Smooth one, I think it is, that one is super, super bad and does not rub into my skin very well. So keep that in mind, but I just adore this scent. Please pick this up and give it a sniff if you go to Target or Walmart, please. Next up, we have another body wash, and this is a shower gel from Bath & Body Works. So there isn't one specific scent that I feel like I would continue to repurchase because with my Bath & Body Works scents, I kind of get tired of them quickly, so I'm always rotating them. But currently, I love the Magnolia Charm Body Wash. It just smells so perfumey and perfect for, like, morning and night to be honest I love Magnolia Charm but ultimately I just really do love the formula of the Bath & Body Works shower gels I thought I liked the moisturizing body washes better but honestly I think right now I'm just really into the shower gels I don't know why I also heard that the um what is it called moisturizing body washes are they get expired quicker than these shower gels, which kind of makes sense because they're like creamier, so it's kind of like a body cream. I don't know. But I love the shower gels. They lather beautifully. They smell divine, and it will really help you have that scent last on you if you get the matching lotion, shower gel, fragrances. Like, that's really going to help let your scent last longer. And especially during, like, the crazy sales, like the semi-annual sale, I really stocked up on shower gels a lot more than I needed, but I typically don't ever buy myself their shower gels, so that it was a perfect time when it was 75% off, so yeah. As for deodorant, I know so many of you guys always ask me, like, what kind of deodorant do you love? Like, what deodorant helps you stay fresh all day? A lot of you guys have asked me that, and I always say, you guys already know, my Dove Advanced Care. You can choose any scent you like, but I will always repurchase these two scents. I mean, they're the same scent, but these two, always. So, this is the Pear and Aloe scent. I just love the scent of this. It smells so clean, and it just gives me, like, very much summer vibes. I don't know. I just, I don't know. Sometimes I just really want to smell fresh under my pits. 
I do have like a coconut and vanilla one that I really do enjoy, but for the daytime, especially when I know I'm going to be sweating throughout the day, I love to use this and put the dry spray on top. It is a beautiful combo. You are going to be smelling fresh all day, all night. These are amazing. So pick these up. As for another deodorant, I wanted to give you guys another option. I love this native deodorant and I know I said I don't always like to smell super warm but if I could choose just one nighttime deodorant it would be this one I love the scent of it it is really warm but during the daytime I feel like the scent just doesn't last on me as long and it doesn't help keep my pits dry but it is like aluminum free paraben free so if you guys are into like natural deodorants I just wanted to give you guys an option if someone said I could only choose one natural deodorant it would have to be this one it smells really good but I think this is perfect for nighttime because I don't sweat a lot at night like when I'm sleeping so there was someone outside my door <laughs> but um if you guys want a natural deodorant and you want to try something I think the native ones are really cute the packaging is super sleek and I mean they work great I've tried other natural deodorants like the Schmitz one hate that one I hate the Schmitz deodorants they feel like I'm rubbing like exfoliator under my armpits and it's like scratchy but this one's pretty good I do like this so yeah another thing I just wanted to mention was a body oil I actually don't have it with me right now because I'm trying to finish up my other body oil so I didn't have a chance to go out and buy it but that is baby oil I just think the classic Johnson's baby oil is super good and I love using that as a body oil I have some of their oil gels but Personally, I think I just really do prefer the regular baby oil version, and I think it makes my skin so smooth, so soft, and it helps with razor burns a lot, so get that one. Alright, so next up we have body lotion. So I already showed you guys my OGX body lotion, but here I have a Bath & Body Works body lotion. Now this is one that I've been really into and that I feel like I'm always going to repurchase, and I'm kind of glad because they never take this scent away. This is Cucumber Melon. You guys know how much I love this scent. It just pairs so well with a lot of different fresh fragrances. I know some people don't like this scent, but honestly, I love it. And I also feel like Bath & Body Works kind of changed their formula of their lotions because I was talking to, like, my sister about this, and she was like, I don't know, like, Bath & Body Works, like, lotions used to be so freaking runny. And I was like, they used to be so liquidy and not moisturizing like it didn't feel like they really did anything for your skin but I don't know if they formulated it again it is so good like this is honestly a nice lotion obviously it's not as thick as the cream but I think again for summer I really prefer the lotions it is like moisturizing but not super thick to the point where like I feel like I'm gonna get extra sweaty so I love that about it, and this scent is just beautiful. Another lotion I have to show you guys is one that I've talked about before as well, and this is the St. Ives Smoothing or Soothing Body Lotion in the Oatmeal and Shea Butter scent. This scent is so good. I love oatmeal and shea butter scents. I think there's something about shea butter that just smells so good to me, and I never get tired of like shea butter scents. I feel like I love every single one of them. The body wash is another great thing that I just adore, and I will always repurchase as well, but the lotion just smells so amazing, and the, um, the consistency of this product is pretty thin, but it's thin to the point where, like, it's still doing something for your skin. It's not leaving you still, like, dry and crusty. At least for me, it still moisturizes my skin, and I love how easy it just, like, seeps into your skin, and it doesn't leave, like, a white cast or anything, and there's a pump, plus this thing is super, super affordable. I just think it's perfect. I wish they would come out with a fragrance mist for this because I would totally buy it and wear it all the time. Next up are two fragrance mists that I just wanted to mention. You guys can probably already guess some of my favorite all-time body mists that I will always repurchase. And the first one we have here is Gingham by Bath & Body Works. You guys can see I've used up so much of this. Like, this is just a scent that I think is so timeless and just smells amazing for any occasion. It 
can truly be worn on any occasion and any time of day. There's nothing like smelling fresh and clean. And you guys know I have a lot of fresh and clean fragrances from Bath & Body Works. And to be honest, this one probably has to be like my all-time favorite. I just love like the citrus note in here and the linen note. It is so beautiful. And it's not over like... It's not overbearing of that linen note, like Beachfront Blanket can kind of be for some of you guys. So, yeah, I love this one, and she is my baby. Next fragrance mist is by Victoria's Secret. I kind of wanted to do, like, one from each category. So, this is another fresh fragrance. I mean, I just think fresh fragrances are amazing. And this is Aqua Kiss. Honestly, I don't know why, like, I've been sparingly using this. I don't know why, like, I think that they're not going to bring it back or anything because they always have this. This is part of their signature collection. But Aqua Kiss smells like a straight-up perfume. It smells so expensive. If you want to smell rich on a budget, please, please, please get this product because you will love it. The fragrance notes are Cool Waters and Bright Daisy and the daisy in here is perfect. It's not too strong of that floral note, but it's also not too aquatic. I just feel like they're so perfectly balanced out and they just complement each other of, like so well. So I love this scent and it is so good. And sometimes I even mix these two together and they go together beautifully. So there's a little fragrance combo for you guys as well. Last thing I wanted to share with you guys is a perfume and I really just wanted to show a nice, you know, perfume that I'm sure you guys can find anywhere at your targets at least. This is the Soli Notes of the blog. I have used this up like a pretty good amount for just purchasing this not too long ago. This um, is supposed to smell like white tea and I do think it has like that tea element. But again, so clean and fresh, but it's not like a linen fresh it's more of a like tea fresh if you guys know what tea smells like like it's not like green tea but it's definitely like a tea note in there this is 20 bucks at target and it is so worth the money like i just can't say anything like bad about this fragrance it lasts a decent amount of time for being 20 dollars and i really love like the little mister in here like it is such a nice like even mist and not a stream so i love that about it but yeah definitely pick this one up i think it's totally worth it they have a bunch of other scents in this collection as well so yeah all right you guys so i hope you guys enjoyed seeing all of the amazing hygiene products that I just feel like I will continue to repurchase forever and that I love so much. They are so good. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye! Uh, uh.